Hello, hello, my chalets and show bros. How are you doing? How are you doing? <laughs> oh my gosh. Can't you tell I feel good? <laughs> yes, I do. Oh my gosh. It is so woo, out here. I just got my eyebrows done. My mom treated me. She said, if you don't go get those wild things done. <laughs> I was like, I really don't have the money. And so she looked out for me on that one. And um, so I said, okay, let me go look. Okay, I'll go get a done, mommy. <laughs> so I did. And um, yeah, you can tell it looks different. Sometimes you're so used to seeing yourself in the mirror one way. And then when you do something to, you know, to yourself to just pamper yourself a little bit, it's like, oh, okay, it does give you a fresh look. But yeah, so I listened, mommy, okay? Don't send the boys out, okay? I listened. <laughs> so, um, I see a lot of so, don't I? Anyway, where I went, they're pretty good. Um, if you're familiar with the Montdomon area, uh, they, they really, I like it. I don't get my nails done any longer because it's hard to maintain every two weeks and I do have nails healthy nails but once I get that uh, gel on it it makes it paper thin it, it just I guess if I I don't know I don't know if there's a way you can get it done oh my gosh wow she could have caused an accident and that really would have been an accident because she didn't see the car because the other van is across the pedestrian walkway, which caused her to have a blind spot. Oh my gosh. Wow. We were bonkers. Tax fraud. Oh wow. Um, okay, so I'm sorry. I just see I see signs up. Oh. Uh, uh, you know, giving out information and stuff like that. But anyway, I'm so sorry. Yeah, so I don't know. Maybe I don't know if, if you uh, girls who get your your nails done every two weeks, and if you take them off, are your nails like paper thin? And I understand any nail that is beyond the tip is considered dead. Uh, healthy nail or live nails, if you will, is what is attached to the skin because the blood is, you know, all that kind of stuff, supporting it and all that good stuff. So whenever I get the gel nails, and my nails grow pretty fast, but then I feel like I need to take them off. It just feels so, uh, and when I do, I end up ripping the amount that have uh, grown, and yeah, and then my nail that is attached to the skin it's so paper thin and ah, uh, you know, maybe I should just work on my own nails. I don't know. In time. I tell you what, let me, I'm going to be honest with you guys. Like I, I'm always honest. Sometimes I think too much, but anyway, okay. Um, oh, do I want that? I think I do. I don't know. Let me get going. Oh my gosh. I want to go that way because I want to go to Burger King. Uh, ooh. I've been craving it. I had it yesterday. I had a Whopper and I had uh, the fish sandwich, but I took the bun off and just ate it that way. And that was really, really good. It was very fulfilling and I'm like craving it. I haven't eaten in this one something this afternoon. Again, too much information. Uh, well, this is a vlog. So yeah, back to the nail thing. So I don't know. But let me tell you guys, let me I'm gonna be honest, let me tell you. Woo! It feels so good out here. And I'm like, do I need to go shopping for new clothes? <laughs> I'm just saying. And I might have to do some Uber and Lyft to, just to get some money to get that extra stuff because my bills are good. Thank God they're good. Um, but I I'm I, I'm motivated somewhat to go out here and do an hour or so yeah I don't know 
just to get that extra to help me buy some clothes, <laughs> you know, or just to get my eyebrows done, just to pamper. For some, that might be like, oh, the nerve of you. But I don't know. It, 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 I haven't done it. Uh, yeah, because basically that's what I was doing Uber and Lyft for is for extras and like the phone bills, so on and so forth. Not the major, not the major. I have the major stuff taken care of, so that's a blessing. Um, I, I deserve that. Um, but I, even with if that, if that feeling of me wanting to pamper myself supersede my anxiety, wow, that is awesome because. I never really put myself first. I didn't, you know. Whew. But that would be awesome if I could do that. You know, I'm, uh, yeah. But anyway, guys, uh, why did I come on here? Just to say hi and to share how I am enjoying my beautiful day today. And it's so nice. People are out and, you know. Oh my gosh, I saw a bee the other day. And I remember talking to Aaron. Um, he's a, a, a subscriber. Or he comes in and Joe's live. Oh, she's still around. I've seen this lady. You might see her once I drive by. I don't know if you saw her. She asked for money. And um, I've seen her out late at night when I would do Uber older woman too my prayers go out to her uh yeah so Aaron he um he was talking he had ordered some bees because uh he said that the bees are being extinct so when I saw a bee I, I told the bee you're welcome oh my god and first I, you know usually I'm like ah you know but I was like you know what I've heard a lot about you guys so you're welcome go ahead and fly around and so on and so forth because we need bees. They help with pollination and that's so important. So, alright guys. Don't kill the bees. Keep them alive. <laughs> Let me get off of here. Love yourself. Know yourself. Be yourself. And change yourself to improve yourself. Alright everybody. I am all you. Love you. Take care. Bye. I hit the wrong button. Sorry. Let me see. Oh, oh my gosh. Stop it.